A tokamak is the most advanced of current fusion machine designs. In order to get fusion reactions going, you need to keep your fuel hot enough and dense enough, like the centre of a star, and you need to keep it like that for long enough for fusion reactions to occur. People have tried, and are trying, various different ways of doing this. A machine called a tokamak, a Russian design, is the best way we have found so far. The best performing tokamak in the world is JET, which holds the world record for fusion power produced. The word tokamak stands for toroidal chamber magnetic coils. It's a ring donut shaped vessel with magnetic coils around it that make a trap for the fusion fuel. Inside the tokamak, we heat the fuel to produce a plasma, a superheated gas in the fourth state of matter. We use strong magnetic fields to trap the plasma, and the aim is to hold it stable for long enough for fusion reactions to occur. Within the plasma, the fusion fuels, deuterium and tritium, will then fuse and release enormous amounts of energy. This only happens at high temperatures of hundreds of millions of degrees Celsius. The hot plasma is kept away from the walls of the tokamak by a magnetic field produced primarily by two sets of coils that contain the plasma horizontally and vertically. Fast control systems can change the magnetic field produced by these magnets to keep the plasma trapped and stable. A spherical tokamak is based on the same principles as a conventional tokamak, but it is more squashed up. Instead of a ring donut, it looks more like a cord apple. Spherical tokamaks have four key advantages over conventional tokamaks. They are more efficient because the magnetic field is stronger closer to the centre of the ring and in the squashed spherical design, the plasma sits closer to the centre. They are better at keeping the plasma hotter for longer, something scientists call having a higher energy confinement time. Exactly how much better is still to be proven. They suffer less from instabilities in the plasma which could cause heat to leak out or disrupt operation and so spherical tokamaks can potentially perform better. They have an internal mechanism of producing a stabilising current more effectively than conventional tokamaks, so we won't need to input so much energy to do this. To achieve fusion on a scale feasible for commercialisation, tokamak energy is working with spherical tokamaks and high field magnets.